I'm Janice. And I'm Melinda. And welcome to NFP Kitchen. <laughs> Today we're making cowboy caviar, which um, is a bean dip made with black eyed peas. Um, and it's a really good summer dip uh, that normally you're supposed to eat with corn chips, but I like it just by itself because it's very satiating. You get the black eyed peas and there's avocado, um, so it's really filling and I just like it by itself. So I eat it as a bean salad, you can eat it as a dip, whatever you like. Okay, so this starts with one chopped bunch of green onions. Good onions. Green onions. <laughs> okay, two thirds cup cilantro, chopped cilantro. as well. And if you don't like cilantro, you can add <laughs> flat leaf parsley. Cilantro's better. Yeah, we like cilantro. Um, one can of black eyed peas rinsed and drained. Eh? Uh, eh? Uh. Very good. <laughs> um, one eight ounce can of shoe pig corn. Very important that you Very know. Very important. Shoe pig. And make sure that it's shoe pig corn, not regular corn. The shoe pig corn, I think, is a little bit more tender. The kernels are a little bit longer, and they're just not something that I would swap out on this recipe. No swap. No swap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And that doesn't have to be drained. There's not a lot of liquid in the can. We need the liquid. Yeah, so it's fine. So the recipe calls for two large tomatoes but um, we used two cups here lovely. of lovely sugar plum tomatoes cut in half. Very nice. Very pretty. Mm -hmm. And then this is supposed to be two avocados or um, one and one half cup to two cups avocados. We got carried away. Yeah, there's a lot. <laughs> there's a lot there. But we love avocados so it's fine and the avocados are perfect. So we start off with a half cup of olive oil. All right. Okay. And then we're going to add a half cup of balsamic vinegar. Mm. Oh, yes. We used to make this with pomegranate white red wine vinegar uh, back when pomegranates were having a moment. Uh oh, I hope we have enough. I think they did. Yeah, oh, pomegranates man. were really popular, and that's why we can't find it anymore. Dang it. Okay. All right. So here we have two cloves of garlic, one teaspoon of cumin, three quarter teaspoon of salt, and one eighth teaspoon of pepper. Okay, great. And then the dressing just gets poured over the salad. La, 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 <laughs> la, 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 And then everything gets mixed together. Dun, 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 yes, dun, dun, everything dun, gets dun, all mixed dun, together. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Enthusiastically mixed together. <laughs> We're very excited. Oh, hey! <laughs> I told you I needed a bigger bowl. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I think you're done. <laughs> Sorry, it's not okay. I want it. Can I, can I taste it now? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Um, okay. Hang on. So this is what it looks like when it's done. Um, it's better actually on the second day, but I wouldn't wait too much longer than that to eat it because it gets a little grainy. Okay. Hang so on. here we are trying the, the cowboy caviar. It's right here. Me we'll too. figure out how to film one of these days. <laughs> All right. Okay. Hang See? On. Yeah. Hey. Not vegans. Try this. Mm -hmm. And vegans try this. And vegans try this. Vegetarians, whatever you are. Cheers, cheers. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. And that's So this is really filling. It's got fat from the avocados. It's got fiber from the beans. You get lots of uh, antioxidants from the tomato, 
from the avocado. The cilantro is delicious. I can smell it and I love the cumin. The, the, everything that goes into the salad is just delicious. It's very light. It's very easy. And you can eat it with corn chips or we just eat it. I can literally just eat this by the spoon right out of the bowl. Like it is that good and you are full. Like you feel full after this meal. There's no yeah. omnivores out there. If you're afraid, oh no, if I eat plants, I'll be hungry. You eat a good serving of this and you'll be full and you'll find that your body's happy because it's getting good fats. Yeah. That keep you happy and going. This is my mom's recipe and we used to eat this before I was vegan. Um, and they're, uh, I'm still the only one in my family who's vegan. So um, we ate this because it was good, not just because it's a, a vegan option. It's really um, a tasty meal. And I didn't know what cowboy caviar was before. And I yeah, was really afraid she was gonna break out some eggs. Name. And I'm like, you're vegan, you don't mm -hmm. do this. Yeah. So this salad gets, this salad gets a 10 out of 10. It's Woo. delicious, it's healthy. I would definitely feed this to my family and they would not gripe about it because well, there's no meat replacement in this. It's just vegetables and beans and legumes, all those delicious things that I think they'd be happy to incorporate. I literally could stick this in front of dad and he would probably eat the whole bowl. Like he'd just be like, no, 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 no. That's so great, I can picture that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so definitely yeah. 10 out of 10. I love it to death. You can change it up a little bit because I know everyone's got their own taste, but for the most part, it's solid. Happy omnivore over here. So that's Cowboy Caviar. See you guys in the next video. Please um, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. We will put the recipe uh, in the description box below. Yay! Bye!